<laughs> Can we straight out to get? G'day guys, welcome back to another episode. Me and Strider just rocked up to the beach and it is absolutely beautiful at the moment. It's like a dead glass off. The tide's just running out and we got the whole damn beach to ourselves. Check it out. <laughs> Woo, what do you reckon, Eddie? How good is this? A couple of zoomies, eh? Ready? Go Strider! <laughs> Look how beautiful it is! Oh, is that? That was a queen fish jumping. I got the jig in the car. Little slug here. Fingers crossed for something. Oh, on. On. Oh, 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 Something hit it right on the shoreline. Woo. Beautiful little fish. Oh, the girl. There you have it, guys. Beautiful little grunter straight off the beach. Oh, there you go. Thanks, buddy. Oh, that was super fun. Super, super fun. Ah, march fly. Okay, got him. All right. <laughs> Sorry about the distraction, guys. Oh, I, I couldn't help myself. I've seen a fish and I just, oh, I took over. Anyway, the real episode is with this bad boy here. I bought myself a $50 hand spear. It just, it just screws together like this. It's not special in any way. But the other day, a um, couple episodes ago, me and Emily went camping and I gave myself a secret challenge to try and land a fish with this and second shot of this i got myself a solid little blue bone bent all the all the prongs back it was super super fun i swam down tried to get a trout just had like i hit it but it just bounced off didn't do any damage to the trout or anything but somehow i managed to land a fish with this and i'll roll on some of those clips
Oh, I can't believe that. Oh, look at that. I got a full size blue bone on my $50 hand spear. <laughs> I can't believe I got this nice blue bone on a pole spear, hey. But not just a pole spear, a gigi. Like I used to use one of these when I was like a grummet grummet. Learning how to spear dive. It cost me 50 bucks, I bought it yesterday at the dive shop. And uh, what happened is I went down for a trout the first time. I hit it under the rock, but it was just too big. It pretty much just bounced off and the trout swam away. Got my breath back up. I went back down after another big trout. Followed him into a cave and he shot off. And then this guy's popped in, got him. He, he was shook, he come back around, did a Yui, and I got him again, and I actually must have hit, hit the spine a bit, or the brain, and he started doing kicks, but he tore off, and he was down around the bommie, and I thought I lost him. Come back up, and then he popped out the bommie onto the sand, still kicking, I got back down, got the third shot in him, and got him, and that is so cool. I really wanted to do this, and I didn't think it was gonna happen that quickly. But um, it's a lot harder to do than it looks. So I'm so stoked and I think I'll retire me $50 hand spear for now. <laughs> Bent all the prongs out. Like they're all buggered. It's just such a cheap bit of crap really, the spear. <laughs> <laughs> So I've come to the conclusion Just a rotten piece of fruit So I'll end up dying slowly Rotting away See I just want to be able To climb without So there you go, a little hand spear action. We call these a gigi. I um, grew up when I was like a grommet under 10, practicing on these before I got myself a spear gun. That's probably one of the biggest fish I've ever got in a gigi. I have got a fair few good fish on the old pole spear. Geez, I might not even be cooking till the sun goes down at this rate, but I'm absolutely frothing guys, hey, this is, this is the shit. The sunset was freaking amazing. Ah, oh, can you blame me? And then the fish and then everything else. But it doesn't even matter. This is what it's all about. Just like no plan, doing whatever comes. Like, ah, oh, there's an eagle just there, look. Hello, buddy. All right, check out my little lunchbox here. Got some green shit, some cheese, bit of butter, bit of butter there. Um, and then here is the fish that I prepped earlier. Let's get this seasoning. Oh, where's the seasoning? Shit. Yeah, yeah, no, I got it, I got it, I got it. All right, guys, let me just quickly prep up this uh, blue bone. I've already got it cut up. I just need to chuck some seasoning on it, get the hot flakes warm, cook it up, and get straight into some fish hangers. I'm so excited. <laughs> there we go, just a reminder of what slayed the blue bone <laughs> and gave me dinner. I was in a crazy rush and all I could find were these weird Weber hot plate things. I don't even really know what they're for, but uh, I chucked them on there. <laughs> Hopefully, it should work. There's fish on the, on the go right now, eh? Look at that, straight on. 
How yeah, good. Fresh blue bone. Looking good. And the old hand spear. Look at that bad boy. And it cost me 50 bucks, believe it or not. And uh, she did the trick, but I think I'll have to retire after, after that one fish because of all the bent prongs. Absolutely beautiful sunset. It's still kicking on. It just doesn't want to stop. But Strider Dog over here, digging a china. What are you doing, Strider? What are you done? You're crazy. What's in there? <laughs> You're an idiot. Oh, she's almost completely gone. <laughs> Let's have a look at this. Oh! That is starting to look bloody good! Got to get my foundation down. Some secret sauce. Straight on like that. A bit of cheese. Bang on there. Get ready for the meat. That's looking pretty bloody good. Oh baby, this looks like it's just ready to melt in my mouth. Oh, straight on the hot plate. I mean, straight off the hot plate, straight onto me bloody Sanger. Are you kidding me? Oh, close that. Look. Oh, la, la, la. Um, bit of green shit, straight on the top. Don't even think about it, just chuck it on there. What do I got? Secret sauce, cheese, green shit, fish. Boom, boom. Oh, baby. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. The famous fish sanger. Oh, mate. That is bloody beautiful. That is bloody beautiful. Absolutely amazing. There you go, guys. The old $50 hand spear. Got myself a blue bone, come down the beach, beautiful afternoon, cooked up some fresh fish, gonna smash a couple of these sangers, let's try to have a little bit of fish. Hang out here for a little bit longer, all those March flies are buggered off now. That's it for another episode, if you like it, give it a thumbs up, if you want to see more, make sure you guys subscribe. Get your merch, youngbloods.co if you want to support us. Just, oh, I'm frothing guys, thanks for everything, and I'll see you guys in a couple of days. Cheers. Mm. Ooh. Gotta shake it real good, baby. Ooh.